Hey, what's going on? It's that time. Still standing Saturdays. Man, super excited to break down these lyrics. I hope this is giving you a little um, insight, you know, into the mind of Jahai as I was going through this whole album, Still Standing, um, out now on GodFirstMusic.com. You can go check that out, stream it, download it. Shout out to my cousin, just downloaded a digital copy. Um, yeah, uh, it's, it's out there. Um, it's also, also got merch, man, God First Music t-shirts. This isn't a God First Music t-shirt. This is a Jordan t-shirt, but uh, I got hats. Man, talk to me, man. So anyways, uh, the song that I'm going to be talking about today is the infamous Hills and Valleys. Oh my gosh, right? Uh, crazy, crazy um, song. I, I wrote this song at Starbucks on Esplanade. I remember it uh, like it was yesterday to that rhyme, you know? Um, but yeah, man, I, I wrote this song, man, probably in like 30 minutes, man. It just came and... This is kind of like my, my journal entry, you know? Um, you know, I feel like a lot of times, man, through social media, man, you get to see my highlight reel. You know, you get to see the, uh, you know, the fun times, the, you know, laughs, the smiles and all this stuff. But it's very rare that, man, you get to see somebody's cutting room floor, um, you know, on social media, man. That's the stuff that, man, we don't really like to talk about, right? Um, but man, this song is literally my cutting room floor. This is not my highlight reel, man. I even had a little bit of anxiety, man, leading up to, man, doing this one right here, you know? Uh, last week, uh, we, we did the motionless, and the whole thing that I was talking about in the motionless was um, about being vulnerable and helping guys step into vulnerability. And, you know, it was pretty cool. Um, I figured this out after I did the track list, but um, I literally talk about vulnerability. Then the next song is me getting probably the most vulnerable, you know, and, and there's so much uh, correlation with how the tracks were listed and everything, you know. So um, Hills and Valleys, this is a song uh, by Torn Wells. And man, come on, there's a couple songs that literally got me through my my uh valleys you know in uh in 2018 um and so this is one of them you know this is one of those songs i had on on repeat you know um man going through all that stuff and man the the, the words are so powerful in this song hills and valleys right um in the chorus it says on the mountains i will bow my life to the one who set me there right and and that's literally like something that we neglect to do you know there's mountains in our lives that's, that's the high times and then there's valleys in our lives and when we're on the mountains man we're not typically thinking about god we're not typically thinking about what got us there right and so when torn wells is saying on the mountains i'm gonna bow my life right i'm gonna bow down like man to god because he's the one that set me there on that mountain right um, in the valley, I will lift my eyes to the one who sees me there, right? That's the truth. Man, God sees you, man. You may be in a valley right now. You may, man, have been in a valley. You may be going to be in a valley soon. Can I tell you that God sees you? He sees you right there, right? Um, and so you can lift your eyes because he sees you, right? When I'm standing on the mountain, um, I know I didn't get here on my own. Right. This is man giving glory to the one who man brings us to the mountains and, and stuff. Right. When I'm walking through the valley, I know that I am not alone. You are not alone. You know, a valley is that low place. A valley is man, that hardship, that trial. Right. He is the God of the hills and the valleys, the hills and the valleys. Right. I'm not alone. Powerful, powerful imagery, you know. And so. Man, basically, man, I go into um, I go into my story, man, into in this song, and um, man, it's uh, it's true, you know. I'm literally just writing exactly what I saw. This is actual truth, right? Like, um, man, just if you if you couldn't tell already by man listening to the album or listening to the songs, uh, my ex-wife left me for my ex-best friend. Boom, right there. 
Um, and so, man, with the first couple lines in the in the first verse, um, on the day that she left, I felt this weight in my chest, had me fighting for my breath like my max on the press. Literally, um, I had my first panic attack. You know, talk about being vulnerable right there, right? Um, never really could. Uh, relate to people that struggled with anxiety before so i've never struggled with that um but literally man first panic attack man through this whole situation and i remember being talked through and so i'm talking about um had me fighting for my breath like my max on the press breathe in count to four breathe out count to eight literally being coached like okay breathe in count to four now breathe out count to eight right you gotta slow the rhythm you gotta get on rhythm like with your breath to get out of a panic attack right literally uh all new stuff right to me um as i look up to god with my eyes full of hate man literally going through the situation i i did you know i probably like threw up a finger you know um just out of pain and, and anger right um you said you had a plan but now i'm questioning my faith literally um went through a time of man really questioning like okay man like you said you had good plans like what is this and i know there's so many people out there and i'm hoping man by me sharing my story you can relate man if you've ever been through this before or been through something similar man there's times where man even i right the word of the day wednesday guy right the not a freestyle friday christian rapper all this stuff man where even i question my faith right and um and the important part is I didn't stay there, right? I didn't keep that to myself. I let people in. I talked to people about that questioning of my faith and um, and was able to make sense of, man, my situation. Um, and so I want to encourage you, man. You may be questioning your faith right now. You may be going through a hard time right now. You may be going through a valley. You may be on a hill. You may be on a mountain. And maybe, man, you need to hear this song because, man, whether you're on the mountain or in the valley, you need to know that God brought you to that mountain or he sees you in the valley and he's going to help walk you through that. Right. Um, uh, later on, uh, at the end of the first verse, man, is really this is how how you get through the valley. Right. I'm making progress daily without you by my side. At an age to the mess one day at a time, right? Now, uh, super cool, that last line, right? At an age to the mess. When you add age to a mess, that's a message. Mess age, message, right? And so I literally, man, got that, you know, to, to end that, that line. And, and that's the truth, right? Man, when you add time, one day at a time. As you're walking through the valley, as you're walking through that hardship, as you're walking through that trial, you take it one day at a time, right? And when you add age to that mess that you're in or that mess that happened to you or whatever, man, you get a message, right? My message is still standing. I'm still standing, baby, right? Man, through all this, man, everything crashing down and all around me, I'm still standing. That's my message when I added a little time, added one day at a time. And you know what? I didn't get there, man, in the blink of an eye. I didn't get there overnight, man. There was a lot of, man, tears in between there. There's a lot of anxiety and, man, just wrestling and, and all this stuff. But there's just people, right? Man, shouts out to, man, Grayson Collins, man, Jose Camberos, man, just seriously rocks in my life, you know, to kind of walk me through uh, this valley, right? Um, you know, and this is literally, uh, this is literally how you, man, get through this, right? You, you got to make a, a message out of that mess, you know? Um, this part that you're hearing right there, um, this is actually an ad lib that uh, Jared... You're the same God of the hills and the valleys. This is a um, ad lib that Jared just did in the studio, you know, um, when he was singing. Shouts out to Jared, another one of those rocks in my life through this whole thing. Um, but uh, man, super man, fired up, you know, to to hear him on that. And man, he man, that that's that's the absolute truth, man. He's the same guy uh, that man has us on the hills and the valleys. Um, you know, it's literally what it is, man. This is uh, the real, raw, man, 
part of my story, you know, vulnerable part of my story. Um, so it's a it's a doozy, you know. But man, that's it. Still standing Saturdays. Um, I'm gonna try to keep these to about ten minutes. Split them up. I'll post one today. Maybe post one during the week. Uh, hope you guys got something out of this. Hills and valleys. Go ahead and listen. Um, GodFirstMusic.com. I'm also on that Piff if you want a free download. Also, come see me. I got CDs if you have a CD player. Not a lot of people have CD players anymore. But, um, yep, that's it. <laughs>